Hello everyone, welcome to another Amnesia video. As you recall, last one... Whoa, what's this? <laughs> uh, as you recall in last one, uh, we got a monster chasing after us right before I ended it. And that was pretty freaky. Whoa. Okay, and so we can lift the latch. Eh. Ugh. Huh. What's this? Cistern. I don't like this. I feel like a monster's gonna come kill me. <sighs> Servants avoided him, yet he knew where... Oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> oh, this place! I remember seeing this from this one from the screenshots. So you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. <clears throat> okay, so here, I think, judging by that, we're gonna have to use the poisonous fungi to try and kill Arthur Brennenberg. I think, was it Arthur? Andrew? I can't remember. Mr. Brennan... Mr. Brennenberg. No, that wasn't his name. <laughs> I'll just call him the Baron. Whatever. Um, lever is stuck. Its gears need to be greased. Okay, so judging by that, I think we're going to have to go down this way. Oh no, is there going to be a water monster? The water is too deep to traverse safely, so no water monster today. Alright, let's see what we can do here. That's broken. This is broken. Um, doesn't look like anything else, so I guess we just move on. It won't budge! What do we do then? Oh. There's a ladder. Yeah, well, I don't think we can climb that up that. Maybe we can... No object to use the item on. Um, what's this? Oh, there we go. A broken pipe. It it got somewhat. A broken pipe is blocking the ladder. However, it some got somewhat damaged by the impact. Can't use an item in this way. Oh, there we go. I know. We have to keep crashing on this. Yeah. There we are. <laughs> it's the first ladder we've ever come into in the game. And I doubt it will be our last. I forgot to set the timer. Start. Alright. So we can keep going. What are these? What did you write down, Daniel? You cryptic man. To enter the sewer, it first must be drained. Repair the machine power in the eastern bridge. What about this bridge? Oh. Oh, there we go. This is pretty cool. Okay, cistern. Aren't we already in the cistern? Oh, 
The red taint burst from the walls as if they had begun to bleed. He cried out in fear as the spectacle began to consume the blue shimmer. I'm assuming that that uh, red whoa lag. I'm assuming that the red taint was that uh. You're conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like the drinking? Yeah, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mills. Exactly. Okay. So obviously, we're going to need to be using this water at some point. Oh, it's... Uh, is that just deep water, or...? Oh yeah, it is. It's just reflection. Okay, let's take a look over here. No! Ugh! There we go. Nope. What is that? What was that all about? 7th of August, 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going, and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon, where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. I see. So the orb's shadow is basically all the monsters that are attacking us and stuff. All the taint and crap like that. I can only assume. Alright, let's head over here. What's what that sound? Huh. Hold on. Okay. Water is going to slowly fill the chamber. Oh, this chamber. Oh, at first, I thought I was going to like drown in here. Vision's going all crazy. Whoa. Okay, calm down, man. It's okay. It's, we've got plenty of light here. Look. Plenty of light. Okay. So, um, can we push this down? It's attached to a rusty chain in the ceiling. Um, what else do we have that we could use? Could throw a hammer at it. No object to use the item on. Acid. Yeah. I don't know if we'll use acid. I think that's a bit past. Yeah. Ah. Maybe, I'm not sure. Probably has something to do with that. Ugh. Come on. Do I really have to go all the way back? I know there's going to be one of those water monsters that's going to be in this area, and I don't like that at all, because that was the one monster that was able to kill me. OK, 
Okay, not there. Oh, God, Daniel. You're making this so hard to look at. Oh, come on. What kind of a wimpy jump was that? Let's check over here on the ground. No, can't jump up there. Um, I don't know. Wait, what's this? Nothing important. I guess we can't go over here just yet because we don't have anything to do or anything to fix the problem. I'm just gonna use my lantern so Daniel doesn't have a cow. Over here. There. Steam is gone. Whoa. Okay, uh, let's go over here. Whoa, I almost fell off. Redirect sewer water. Okay, I'm gonna read this note. 8th August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. And that feeling is well deserved, Daniel. Um, is there anything else over here? Maybe we're, nope, no, I can't move those boxes, so no. Alright, how much our time looking like? Eight, okay. So we'll just get our way back. And see what the redirecting of the sewer water did for us. Well, actually, I think I might end it here. Because uh, I don't want to get into anything, because I feel like if I do, then something else is going to happen. So, until next time, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and yeah. See you guys later. Alright. There, you're in two of my videos.